The terrorist attacks a decade ago claimed nearly 3,000 American lives. To honor victims of the terrorist attacks, thousands across the nation gave back to their local communities. That includes many here in northeast Wisconsin through an event put on by an area Muslim community. As Fox 11's Beth Jones explains, its members say trying to fit in has been an uphill battle since 2001. It's a day of remembrance, but many are being proactive and giving back. It was the right thing to do. Like Carol G. of Oshkosh. The Ahmadiyya Muslim community, along with the Community Blood Center, hosted a blood drive in honor of the September 11th anniversary. People who live here should know how blessed we are, and they should do their part. To me, the biggest lesson of, the, uh, of that whole incident in 9-11 was the, the, uh, the courage of the first responders and firemen and people like that that went in to you know, run to the fire instead of away from it to try to help people out. So that's just my way of trying to help out, too. The drive is part of a national Muslims for Life campaign. Over the years, those in the Muslim communities have been trying to shed a positive light on the Islamic faith with community-based events like this. The best way we could do it is follow the tenets of Islam to the best of our ability and show the community that Islam is a religion of peace. Islam tells all Muslims that they should be love, loving their homeland. However, members say it hasn't been easy. Because that notion is always there, that you are being looked at differently. Uh, you, you wear a cap, you wear, have a beard, you're just being looked at differently. So in that sense, we're always uh, worried about it. And it continues to be an uphill battle. Now, Oshkosh actually has been very supportive uh, all around. We have had any issues uh, from that aspect of it. Nonetheless, uh, from a national standpoint and just from a faith standpoint, it has been our struggle to make sure that our name continues to uh, remain on the positive side. But despite the struggle, Ahmed feels progress is being made. When I look at my children, when I look at how my daughters uh, sit with their friends, I don't see religion in their eyes. I have strong uh, hope for our children that they're going to grow out of this thing. In Oshkosh, Beth Jones, Fox 11 News. Nationwide officials hope to collect 10,000 units of blood through the blood drive, which they estimate will help save 30,000 lives.